Do you want to make the most personalized emails for our customers? Okay, I know that perfect plugin and add-on that will help you do that, but before moving on, you will need to subscribe to our channel, put your thumbs up, and not forget to enjoy the video. Ta -da -da! The plugin's name is Yaymail, and the add-on is Yaymail Conditional Logic Add-on. So, uh, here you can see it appeared here in Yaycommerce, uh, and here we are clicking on Yaymail. So this is the dashboard of Yaymail, and our conditional logic uh, appears when we click on a, any block, and here we can see add conditional logic uh, function. So let's now see what we can do with Yaymail conditional logic add-on and what kind of personalized emails we can get. For our first conditional logic, let's customize our thank you email letters. So let's say we are sending thank you email letters to all of our customers, but we are additionally sending uh, additional information to our customers who uh, have bought a sofa or some kind of furniture. Uh, so in this case, we have a sofa and uh, we are sending additional information on how they can clean and wash their sofa. So basically, uh, the other customers do not need this. So we are uh, clicking uh, on this block and we are going down and adding a conditional logic. Here we are choosing a product. So the product is sofa. So in case our uh, purchaser has bought a sofa, uh, this, em uh, this part of this email will be displayed for them. Otherwise, it will not be. Um, okay, so let's say uh, another way we are thanking our customers is giving them discounts. Uh, for this, let's add a text here and create a coupon code for them. So we are let's say giving them 30% uh, off for their next furniture uh, purchases. We also can add it here, the color, let's say it is blue or pink. Okay. So again, for this, we need to click on our blog and again, uh, go down and add if our product is sofa, then this block of this email will be displayed for them. Otherwise, it will not be. And now let's customize another specifically tailored email content for our recipients. So let's say in this case scenario, our customers had bought uh, some clothing and we are sending them an additional block of, uh, for example, um, um, looks and how they can match some clothes together, etc. So for this, uh, let's from, uh, choose the three columns option from a general section and add it here. And here uh, we need to add uh, for each of this column an image. And then here we are changing this part. I will now this quickly and we'll get back to this and do the rest together. So now we have our uh, free columns uh, uh, block available and now we are simply adding our uh, images here. So I'm gonna start with this and our last one is here. So uh, once we have chosen our uh, free images, um, but I think we will need to choose square ones so that it is a uh, perfectly uh, a good design. But in this case, uh, let's uh, stay like this. Um, okay, so for this, we need again to click on our block and then go add conditional logic. And we are choosing our product here. Uh, we are here choosing the product for our condition. Our product is and we are choosing a um, t-shirt, let's say, or a, uh -huh, here, a t-shirt. We can add also a jacket or anything related to our uh, clothing category. And uh, so this uh, particular block will be displayed uh, only for those who had bought, for example, t-shirt and jacket. Um, 
then we can also go here and add a social icon here when we click here we can simply edit this part so i will uh, delete this and i will add my social icon of uh, instagram and i will pass our link of instagram it's a men's fashion uh, outfit so i will click save and here we can uh, see our icon uh, available again you can choose here your um, uh, colors and uh, here we can choose colorful and then again uh, if you want to like uh, send this to everyone the social button which is reasonable but in case you want to uh, only send this to people who had bought for example t-shirt and jacket then you can again add a conditional logic here choose uh, your product product is and add your uh, products that you want specifically this blog to be displayed for that's it for today, and I hope the video was useful. But if you still have any questions concerning Yamel conditional logic add-on, don't forget to drop them in the comments, and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Thanks for watching. Bye.